There's one more thing I'd like to do to improve the functionality of my move functions. And that is to make my robot pause briefly between moves. Uh, the reason I want to do this is because robots, real robots in the real world have momentum. And if you can pause just briefly, then you can break that momentum and it'll cause your robot to behave more consistently. Instead of turning, you know, full bore one direction and then trying to uh, reverse motors uh, instantaneously, that brief pause allows the robot to stop and then once the momentum is broken, go on to its next task. To do this, we're going to create a pre uh, a default argument. So I'm going to say time, but I'm going to set it equal to a number. The advantage of doing this is I won't need to uh, actually put in a number here when I call stop. It'll automatically default to 200 milliseconds. However, it, it does allow me the flexibility to, when I, to put in a number when I call stop and have it stop for a greater period of time. The next step here is to put in a delay and I'm going to delay for time. Now if I try to, if I, I'm going to use the verify button to see if this is going to actually work. And if you do, if you do this, you'll see that it won't work. And it's complaining because now this stop function, uh, it's, it's got this default argument that the compiler doesn't like. It's a weird quirk of the Arduino um, compiler. So what you have to do is take your stop function and put it above all of the functions that actually use the stop function. So I can put it right up here. And if I verify it now, it should work just fine. It looks like it's verifying. Um, to make sure that this actually works, I'm going to make the pause a little bit larger. And then we can go back and set it afterwards. So I'm going to load this to my robot. And I'm going to run the exact same code I had in the last video. But I should see a brief pause when I do it. I'm going to go ahead and set that back to 200. And you are done with the basic movement functions for the nano mouse.